Hello, this is Steve uh, again uh, coming to you. Today we will continue learning the verb to be. Verb quickala. Uh, uh, the verb to be we learn in D. Remember this one? D. So we're going to learn send D. Would D. Would D. Would D. Then we learn. Uh, to D, we are. We learn Moody. We learn uh, Badi. They are. So, and in all those we learn, we, we want to emphasize on. D, D, which I am. As I showed earlier, D is this way. D, I am. D, Steve. I am, which means I am Steve. And I have a few examples we have. Hello, you you following me? I have a few examples we have, for instance, I am, uh, I am weak, I would say. D, Muzose. Or D, uh, I believe that the word uh, it means uh, I am weak. We can say which is uh, I am tired. Uh, another one is I'm strong. I'm strong. Uh, we can say um, there's too many things to talk about here. Uh, we can say, I'm sorry, organize my papers. Uh, we can say, for instance, Dimulampe, I'm tall. I'm tall, we write it this way, I'm tall. And then we can say, Dimuipi, uh, I'm short. We write it this way, I'm short. And then we can also say, if we want, we can say, I'm, I, am, uh, I am a teacher. Di mufundiji. Hmm? Teacher is mufundiji or I am a teacher. Di mufundiji. Or, uh, when some say, I am a teacher, we can say, di muadimu. Hmm? I also gave that uh, uh, and so on and so on. There are too many examples we will be going on with and D and then uh, I think this week, this coming week as we start, we will talk about Ndine, which is the verb uh, to have, uh, the, the verb to have. For instance, D Mwana Masomo, I am a student. D Mwana Masomo, I am a student. And so on. So there are multiple, multiple examples we're going to go through. It's one way of learning how to speak Kiluba. You say Ndi means I am. Ndi, I am. If, if we say Amiwa, which means me, we can say or I. Um, so we we'll learn a lot of that way and we we improve our, our understanding of ndi. So if we say ndi, it means that I am. Uh, we can say ndi, udi, udi, ndi, muadimu, which means uh, uh, I am uh, I am a teacher. Udi, muadimu, he is a teacher. Udi, muadimu, he is a teacher. And then so it means ndi muadimu, udi muadimu, you are a teacher. And then udi muadimu, which means he is a teacher. We are, uh, we are teachers, which is tudi muadimu. You are teachers, is a mudi muadimu. And then uh, uh, they are teachers, uh, we can say badi muadimu. Uh, okay? Or uh, which is uh, 
which which is uh, teachers, and then we are the mukomo. I am strong. We will talk about mukomo. The mukomo. I'm strong. We you would <laughs> you who are strong. We say udi mukomo, and then if we are talking about the other one, we say he is strong. Udi mukomo, then we are strong. We we'll say to the bakomo, and then uh, we we'll say you are strong. If there are many of them, we we'll say. Mu, uh, you are strong, we say, Mudi Wakomo. Then, uh, uh, if they are strong, we say, Badi Wakomo. So, uh, that's one uh, about Mukomo. Let's talk about Mulampe, and we'll go through everything. Mulampe means tall. Mulampe means tall. I'm tall. I am the uh, Mulampe. Uh, you are tall. Means uh, Udi Mulampe. Uh, he is tall. Udi Mulampe. We are tall. We means uh, Tuiva Lampe. Tuiva Lampe. And then, uh, oh, Tudiva Lampe. Then we say, You are tall. Mudiva Lampe. Then, uh, and they are tall. We, we say, Badiva Lampe. That makes me think about all those giants when the Israelites were, were, were about to, to take possession of uh, Canaan and in, uh, or take possession of the promised land. And they said people were, they were giant. They were giant, they were tall people and strong people and all those qualifications. And if we go uh, to Muipi, let's talk about Muipi. Uh, Muipi means short. If I say di muipi, I am short. Udi muipi, means you are short. Udi muipi means udi 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 muipi means he is short. And then to the baby means we are short. Moody baby, Mister, you are short. Badi baby, Mister, they are short, and so on. And um, let me find another one, and uh, at least one more. Moana uh, masomo. I am uh, a student. Di moana masomo. You are a student. Udi moana masomo. Uh, he is a student. Udi Mwana Masomo. We are students. Tudi Wanaba Masomo. You are students. Badivan. Mudi Wanaba Masomo. Then the last one is they are students. Badivana Ba Masomo. And so and so on. So we try to take time learning those uh, this verb and I'm gonna be adding uh, verb uh, to have and so we'll go forward and learn and more and more and if you it happen you to write to me and please write and let me know comment and I will also read your comments and try to improve and try to see if there is something else I can do otherwise we a proverb is coming up this week uh, to learn and after all those two uh, previous proverbs we already learned so a uh, Talk to you soon and God bless you. I love you. Shalapo, 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 shalapo.